Here's how to get multiple images into your Google Slides presentation without any hassle. It's actually really simple. First, open up the presentation you're working on or start a new one. Then, find the folder on your computer or in your Google Drive where you keep your picture. To grab several images at once, click on the first one you want, hold down the Shift key on your keyboard, and then click on the last one in the group you need. That selects everything in between. Once they're all highlighted, just drag the whole bunch right onto your open slide. You'll see them all pop up together. They'll be selected, which means you can move them around or change their size as a group right away. If you want to make them all smaller or larger at the same time, grab one of the corner handles on any selected image. Hold the Shift key again while you drag that corner handle in or out. This keeps everything looking proportional and changes the size for every image you just placed. Of course, you can always click on each one individually later if you want to adjust them separate. Maybe you want each picture on its own slide. That's easy too. Just copy the image you want by selecting it and pressing Then, make a new slide quickly by pressing Click on that fresh slide and paste your image in with To line up several pictures neatly on one slide, select the ones you want to organize. From there, head up to the Arrange menu. Pick a line to line them up on the left, center, or right. Choose Distribute Horizontally or Vertically to spread them out evenly with nice spacing. When everything looks just right where you put it, you can group the images together. Select them all, go back to the Arrange menu, and click Group. Once they're grouped, They'll stick together like a team whenever you need to move or resize them. If you later needed to tweak just one picture in that group, no problem. Select the group, go to Arrange again, and choose Ungroup. That lets you work on a single image. So that's the quick way to bring in and handle lots of images in your slides. If this made things easier for you, feel free to give the video a like and subscribe to the channel. I'd love to hear from you down in the comments too. Catch you later.